Welcome back to my Keep Up channel. Lisa Marsh's son Astel Doherty is a dead ringer for his dad Pete as he makes rare appearance at launch party of his mom's new album Divine Chaos. Lisa Marsh was joined by her rarely seen son Astel Doherty at the launch party for her new album Divine Chaos at the Groucho Club in London. The singer, 52, was joined by her friends and family to celebrate, including her 20-year-old son, who she shares with the libertines Pete Doherty. Lisa put on a racy display for the event, showing off her incredible figure in a leopard print bodysuit and sheer black lace trousers. She added a pair of lacy bunny ears on her head and sported a classic red lip as she performed some of songs for her guests. While Astel looked the spit of his famous father, as he dressed up in a navy shirt with a paisley tie, adding black trousers held up with patterned braces. Lisa and Pete, 45, met when the Libertines were on tour in 2002 and had a brief fling that resulted in her giving birth to Astel the following year. The musician was once banned from seeing his son because of his drug habit, but after going to rehab and getting clean, he became a much more hands-on dad. Speaking to Metro in 2009, Lisa explained, Peter has on and off problems with his recovery, so it was a really difficult decision to make. But when he came out of rehab last year, and started to get his life in order, I thought the time was right. I want Astel to have a dad. Pete was reported to have said, when I can claim to have any sort of control over my own life, I'm going to take some responsibility for Astel. I love the little fella. He also has a daughter, Ashling, 12, with model Lindy Hingston, and welcomed his third child with his wife Katia Davidos last May, a little girl named Billy May. Astel has not only inherited his dad's looks, but has also followed in both Pete and Lisa's footsteps with exploring a career in music. Earlier this year, he made headlines after showcasing his unique singing abilities in a Liam Gallagher tribute act in Essex. The tribute act, dubbed Liam on Sea, was held in January at the Boat Yard, where Astle works as a barman. He went all out to embody the Oasis singer, 51, wearing orange-tinted glasses, shaking a tambourine enthusiastically, throwing out plenty of swear words and even put on a fake Manchester accent. The decision to emulate Liam raised eyebrows, as in what is probably the messiest family tree in rock, Astle's half-sister Molly is Liam's daughter. The singer fathered Molly, 26, in 1998 with singer Lisa, two months into his marriage with Patsy Kensett, but was not involved in her life until 2018. Speaking after his tribute gig, Astle took YouTube channel to address the reaction and clear up any assumptions. He said, It really is as simple as this, my sister and her relationship with her father is her business. My relationship with Liam Gallagher, well I haven't seen the guy in four and a half years. I hung out with him for a little bit. He was a really nice guy. We got along fine. He added, at the end of the day, it's my sister's dad and it's not for me to intrude on that. It's not fair and I wouldn't want to. I'm as average as the next person. Except that I just happen to be related to all these people. If I wasn't related to all these people, I don't doubt that I would be a fan of all these people and I probably still would have done something like this. Discussing his plans for the future Astle revealed, I really want to focus on my own career and do my own stuff. You could say this was a stepping stone. I wanted to prove I could get something like this done, and now I want to prove I can get something else done if that makes sense. He also responded to speculation about Lisa A. current relationship with rock stars Liam and Pete, by saying the subject should be put to bed. He said, in regards to my mum's relationship with Mr. Gallagher and my dad and stuff like that, it's just completely unrelated to all of this. It's the past. The past is the past. The future is the future and the now is now more importantly. Source, dailymail.co.uk Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.